So guys, I am back with yet another Black Myth Wukong video and today guys, I bring you an incredible early game farm. This farm will see you earning roughly 700 will every minute, minute and a half, which obviously helps with you unlocking those sparks, which are used for leveling, progression, you name it guys, this one you don't want to miss. How's it going guys, my name is DPJ and now to celebrate the release of Black Myth Wukong I'm giving one lucky person a chance to win this game and to do that well it's as simple as this drop a like on this video, leave a comment down below and make sure you are subbed the more I see you active on my Black Myth Wukong videos the more of a chance you have of winning I'll pick one person from the comments section and announce them at the end of the week so good luck everybody okay so this will farm or would you call it XP I'm not even sure is more or less near the start of the game. It's a run you can repeat over and over with each run taking roughly about a minute, a minute and a half depending on how powerful you are. I could probably run this in under a minute. It consists of you taking out four enemies. These enemies are slightly spread out but the route is quite quick to get to them. But upon you taking them out you simply fast travel back to that shrine, rinse and repeat and you get a ton of XP in doing this. Or shall we say will, used to get those sparks, used to level up and progress your character. So each enemy drops around 171 to 175 will per one, there's four of these. So you're getting a minimum of 684 of this will, literally every run which can take you a minute, a minute and a half, as simple as that. Now to firstly make this more efficient on yourself, you want to guys make sure you have the incense trail talisman equipped in your quick access slot so you can simply and fastly go back to that nearest fast travel point that shrine we're going to use and go to to farm this will. So the shrine you want to come to guys is the bamboo grove snake trail shrine, it's as simple as that. So from this shrine guys you want to head this way and go up these steps. Now at the top of these steps just by that bridge there will be one of these snake type enemies. I'm not sure exactly what they're called. But each one of these you take out guys gives you between 171 and I think about 175 will. And they're quite easy to take out as long as you surprise them. Uh, with that light combo attack you should take them out so once you take out the first one come back to that bridge and jump down and you'll see another one right there again guys do what you gotta do and take this guy out I mean like I said light attacks very very simple very very easy I mean they probably will get a land off a shot on you but it ain't like they hit very hard at all okay so from here guys you want to turn back on yourself and follow the path I take down here and there's a couple more down here too along with many many other enemies now the other enemies you can take out but I think for efficiency they're not worth it so just run up to this guy right here guys and take him out again I think the smaller guys here those are like skeleton looking snakes only give you like 30 35 will per one you take out so just concentrate on the snakes here by you so take them out and you're good then guys just run slightly forward take it a left and you'll see another one of these snakes in these trees it takes a path walking backwards and forwards so just run this way and you'll see it here guaranteed and then it's as simple as that guys to take this guy out now once you do take this guy out guys obviously access your quick access slots and use that talisman we've just equipped to fast travel back to that shrine and you simply people from here rinse and repeat this over and over you'll see me do this on screen now a few runs I mean it's taking between about a bad minute and a half per run and I'm getting just under 700 will per run here again you can take out the other enemies it will give you more will but I think it will just make efficiency wise a little bit slower now yes I know people are thinking what do you even need this for just play the game yes I know many people are I'm like that I'm not going to use this I'm just doing it for people out there who are looking for this who want to level up earlier on to get themselves a little bit more powerful because some of the enemies in this game some of the bosses are quite difficult I'm not gonna lie they're not the easiest in the world I know a lot of people are saying this isn't a souls like it isn't as difficult as a souls game it really ain't but it's still pretty difficult some of the bosses I mean I'm a veteran on souls games I've done Arno Ring start to finish a couple more of those dark soul type games too I loved every second of it this ain't as hard as them obviously but some of the enemies still in this game are pretty difficult so if players want to use this to get themselves a little bit more powerful so it isn't too harsh on them 
let them do what they want to do but again like i said this isn't for me but i know many many players out there love this kind of thing so take advantage of it while you can again this is early game there's gonna be way better ones than this later on in the game i'm not saying it's the best will xp farm in the game at all all i'm saying is this is a great early game and you also get them as well mine core materials i'm not sure exactly what they use for this early but they seem quite rare i've had about 10 of them drop from these snake type enemies so yeah they're obviously going to be used for some later on down the line so that's good to know again guys once you take out the four snakes you just want to fast travel back to that shrine using that talisman we equipped from your inventory and just repeat this over and over until you have as many as you do indeed need now obviously guys as you are leveling up it's going to take more will to progress through those levels but early game this is great for you to get plenty of will at a quick rate too now, i have tried and tested a few other early game xp farms there are a couple of decent ones i've come across i was going to post another one earlier where it was like about 300 xp every two minutes or 300 will every two minutes i thought at the time then it was quite good i mean i was leveling up quite decently i mean not as quick as this i got like four levels doing this in about five ten minutes so yeah I mean, like I said, it's a, day, it's a decent farm. It's a great early game farm for those sparks. And again, sparks are used to progress your character. Everything important in regards to leveling, you use these sparks. So yes, guys, a great early game farm for you to take advantage of until something better is found. And as always, guys, if something else is found, I will have you code right here on my channel. Now, if you guys are enjoying Black Myth Wukong, uh, make sure you sub i'm gonna post plenty of those daily guides on this game it's just my kind of game as you guys know i love the Elden ring i mean this is the next best thing i've had in a while since Elden ring so yeah expect much much more on this game and again guys if you're watching this video wondering what this game is interested in it if you play it on ps or pc i'm giving away a copy of this game and unlike others my giveaways are actually legit so i'll pick one person who comments on my black myth wukong videos the more i see you active liking commenting the more the chance you have of winning and i will announce them at the end of the week so yeah it's as simple as that guys if you enjoyed the video leave a like really helps out if you like what you see and want to see more be sure to subscribe and hopefully my beautiful people i will see you on that next one